fiesta time and nothing says fiesta like a hot hot chili pepper right all right so we are going to do mr chili pepper today because of course my chili peppers have to have a face on them i uh, originally did uh this for a friend it was a cinco de mayo party but uh there's a lot of uh, parties that are themed around uh, fiesta so it doesn't have to be a cinco de mayo cake so um it's kind of a fun one to do the best thing, most of the time, I'll just actually start carving the cake. But if it's better for you to make a pattern first, there's a couple of ways you could do it. You can go online, Google chili peppers or jalapenos, something like that, and put um, clip, usually clip art because they're the funny caricature type. Um, and you could print out a picture of one and use it kind of as a pattern and then blow it up. Um, or you could just take a piece of parchment like this and just kind of draw whatever you think it would look like. It would be bigger down here, and then cut, usually kind of comes in and out, and then more to a point. Now, you want to keep this a little bit more rounded because it's going to be, you know, your cake is going to be, you don't want it pointed at the end. You need to actually feed people with the cake. So sometimes we don't do things that are, you know, exactly how they should be. Uh, see, I don't really like that. So just, you know, something like this, forget, forget that line. Um, and then you can kind of imagine that he, you know, have a face, a nose, got to have a mustache, a uh, funny grin, right? <laughs> and then he's got to have his top, chili topper thing here with some uh, of the little green, like, leaf type things that come from the stem and maybe a little sombrero over here. And you can see that I really can't draw. <laughs> so don't worry the cake won't look like this he's kind of looks like a pumpkin or something part pumpkin and maybe I'll even you know see I'm much better at actually doing it but if you're actually better at this and then following that what you do is cut this out then place it on top of your cake and then go from there I'm just going to start cutting and um, going for it but that's something that you could do scary crazy all right, do your little lines. Oh, then he looks like a carrot. All right, so this is how I bake my sheet cakes, okay? This is a uh, half sheet pan here. It's not a half sheet regular pan, right? You probably at home have a regular half sheet pan that's two inches high. This one's only about an inch high and my cake actually baked up a little higher. It's okay, just use a half sheet two inch pan and you're fine. That's why I have this separate little piece that I'm gonna be adding here. Then I want to place it um, at the end on this half sheet board, okay? So I can't go too big. I mean, I could go to a larger cake board if I wanted, but uh, I don't really need that much cake for, for what I'm doing. Now, this is just contact paper, so it's not food safe. So I'm actually going to go ahead and place the cake on here, carve it, and then cut it down. Okay, so I let me just kind of move this cake. And he's going to be at an angle, that way I can get more cake out of it. So I think I'll do actually this one first. So let me just grab my, my favorite knife, a serrated knife. And I'm not going to use, I know I'm not going to use all of that cake, so I'll save that for something else. Little pieces, landscaping maybe some. I always save those things for either landscaping or you can let uh, crumble up the cake, let it dry out, and then use it for uh, little crumbs and things for, you know, like dirt or things like that. Okay, so it would be like that. Now for my cake, I actually flip it upside down and I've got this parchment paper on here because that's what I line my pans with parchment paper before I bake them. Okay, and you can see it's way bigger than it needs to be, that's fine. Now if you were gonna put filling in your cake, this is the point that you would wanna go ahead and put your filling in. Okay. I'm not serving this cake, so I'm just gonna be using buttercream. 